Hello Pisces! This is your weekly reading for August 16th through the 23rd. Alright, so your oracle cards for today are Thriving, Power, and Opportunity. So Pisces, I don't know what exactly you've been doing, but you've been doing it right, okay? Because you're doing great. So I feel like you've got some powerful manifestations coming to life. Um, so the overall energy of the reading is Six of Wands, which is success, all right? You're showing up here as your energy, as the Hierophant. So I feel like you're really you really turned into a leader and I do feel like this is a spiritual reading so I'm wondering if some of you Pisces out there are kind of turning into some teachers healers um, mystics um, I do feel like you have a choice coming up you uh, oh, coming up or right now two of wands I feel like you have a choice so, I feel like you're leaving behind more of a physical existence with the Knight of Pentacles here. So, leaving behind a 3D focus. So, moving on from thinking you have to work super hard, nose to the grindstone, all nine to five, put in the hours. Um, moving from that mindset, like how you can create abundance and wealth in your life, moving on from that mindset into more of a, a, a spiritual sense. So, okay, go in order, Christina. <laughs> okay, so, the opportunity is Page of Cups here. So I do feel like you are tapping into your intuition. I feel like messages are trying to come in with this page here. Um, so messages from your, your spirit guides, universe, God, source, whatever you call it. Um, and I do feel like you are going to be moving into this Knight of Cups space. Um, so I do feel like you're going to be tapping more into your intuition. Um, like I said, I feel like you've been kind of in this Knight of Pentacles space where you're focused on creating physical money, monetary wealth in your life. And I feel like you're moving from that into Knight of Cups here. So creating a, a more, a richer, more fulfilling, emotional and spiritual life. So, and I think doing that is going to move you into this Ten of Pentacles space, which is abundance also in the 3D experience. So, while you've been toiling away in the past, putting in tons of hours, um, moving from just the focus on the physical existence to the spiritual existence, by doing that, you're gonna actually be bringing them together and making yourself prosperous in both. So that's great news, right? <laughs> so I think what's in order is a new perspective on work, right? So the hangman here um, was right above your eight of pentacles. So I feel like this is a mind shift, a perspective shift on how, how you create wealth and abundance and do all that in your life. Your hopes and fears is showing up as seven of swords. So I do feel like you're a little bit afraid of being taken advantage of like somebody, like when people um, take credit for your ideas or like you're working in a group project and you're the one doing all the work. I feel like that's kind of holding you back a little bit, that fear, that kind of a mistrust of others. Um, but I do feel like the outcome here is seven of wands. So you have all that you need to 
you know, be creative, to manifest your desires. When, when push comes to shove, you have what it takes to defend your position, convince, bring other people on board. Like, I really feel like you are in a leadership, moving into a leadership position or like um, your energy. You're just, a, you're like, you're a leader. Um, I see a lot of sevens in this reading for you guys. So I do think that you're being supported by your guides in this journey, okay? So I don't think you need to worry about whether I, I can, can I do this, can I do that? Do I have what it takes? The answer is yes, okay? So keep on your spiritual path, do your meditations, your daily practices, whatever they may be, because they're creating opportunities in your life right now, okay? So keep that up. All right, Pisces, that's great news. You're quite successful, in a quite, quite a successful period of time in your life. Um, so have a great week, and I will see you next week, Pisces.